Ding, ding, ding. Oops, I fell over. Deep, 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 deep. Hey! Welcome back, everybody. I'm a Jade Monkey. We're back here in Rust, and we're talking about the Rust Console Edition. Yes, finally, we've got pre-order information, a date, when uh, the betas are going to happen, uh, early access, all that good stuff. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for this. Uh, all right, so let's let's peel this back. Let's 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 see what this is all about. Oh yeah, yeah. if you're a new Rust player, whether you're playing in the closed beta, open beta, early access to the pre-order, to the full release. I do have a Rust uh, Guides playlist. I'll go ahead and link that now in the upper right-hand corner. It's going to help you out on your first days on the wipe. Everything from monuments to base building and all that good stuff. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so this finally is here. We now can pre-order for the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. It's super exciting. Like, I, I'm beyond. Okay, so we're going to check them all out. So apparently there's different levels here. We've got uh, the Standard Edition. It says Rust Console Edition. Future Weapons and Tools. Skin pack, that's awesome. Um, don't really know what that is yet. Uh, we have the Deluxe Edition, which is the Rust. Uh, we have the Future Weapons. We have the Welcome Pack. Three days early access, which is to the full game. And we've got pre-order beta access and staging branch access. Nice, nice. Okay, and then we've got the Ultimate Edition, which has all the other things. And that has Elite Combat Skin Pack and 1,100 Rust Coins. Woo, man, we broke that last year, and there it is, Rust Coins, baby! So we got skins. Uh, we know that, obviously, but it looks like there's a, a marketplace for it. That's awesome. Um, so this is the PlayStation 4. Let's go ahead and see what the Xbox looks like. Same thing over here. <laughs> That's such a heady image, I'm telling you. Oh, my goodness. I'm so excited for this. So check this out. It looks like the release date for this is going to be May 21st. Let me just confirm that. Is it 21st? Yes. Yeah, so it looks like if the pre-order happens, it looks like uh, you'll have access on the 18th of May. How cool is that, right? And it looks like there'll be a continued beta uh, outside of the closed beta that's currently happening, if that makes any sense. So, uh, yeah, how sick is that? Okay, so let's go ahead and check the PlayStation Store. Same stuff here. It looks like you do need PlayStation Plus, RPS Plus. Uh, here is the... And this these are American prices, right? These are um, USD. Ooh, remote play supported. Awesome. I didn't know you guys had that. That's oh, that's sick. That's so hot. Okay, okay. Uh in game optional purchases, PS Plus. So we've got a hundred players. Nice. So it looks like the standard oh, I'm sorry, deluxe is sixty dollars, right? What's the standard one? Let's see, the pre order for American stores. Okay, forty nine, so fifty bones. Nice. Okay. We got a varying degree there. Beautiful, beautiful. And then it looks like the Deluxe Edition in USD is going to be, uh, yeah, fifty nine ninety nine. Oh, does it actually show the date? Nice. Okay, five twenty one. And then for these editions, you've got five eighteen. Is when you can play. So we have three day early access. And here is the PlayStation Store's seventy nine dollars for the Ultimate Edition. And then showing you some of the different features here, which we've already gone through. Closed beta access, public test branch access, which is the staging, and three day early access. And it looks like the uh, the new Cobalt Employee Welcome Pack. Beautiful. Future Tools and Weapons Kit. I just want people to, to see what they're getting and, and, you know, make their choice if they want to. You know what I mean? Oh, my goodness. So uh, the closed beta is still going on right now. We're going to show you the Microsoft Store. The closed beta is still going on. It's under NDA. As soon as the NDA is lifted, we will be showing you, talking about it. You guys can ask us all kind of questions, you know, because we've been playing this on PC since it came out. So you can ask us all kinds of things. Okay, so here's, and again, this would be for May, available on May 20th, 2021. Oh, is it seems like, didn't they say the 21st on this one? Interesting. At 8 p.m. Okay, and this shows you, uh, again, this is crossplay between PlayStation and Xbox. <laughs> this is so beautiful. Oh my goodness, we've been waiting for this forever. It's so nice that we have like a date now, right? We knew spring, but now we go, okay, here's the, is that the ultimate? And this is, oh, here, let me do the deluxe, so we're kind of stepping it up. There's the Cobalt Employee stuff. Let me click on that. What does that look like? I haven't, haven't really had a chance to take again. And again, this, this pertains to PlayStation as well. I was hoping for a bigger image here, but apparently not. That's okay. <laughs> That's so, woo, dude! I'm so excited. We'll show, uh, we'll show some of the trailer. We'll talk over it because I'm not sure there's music on it, and we'll we'll go from there. But oh my goodness, dude! I'm so excited for this. Holy, get the oh man, this looks sick. 
Rust coins. Closed beta access. So we don't know anything else about um, how long this closed beta access will be. But if it's still going on and they lift the NDA and stuff, as we'll talk about it as soon as we possibly can. So there's uh, there's been all kinds of developments happening here. Uh, we will have more information on uh, there's there's another like blog post. Uh, we've already made the video on it, but it should be out later on today. And um, so yeah, you'll be able to see some more information there. We can. Um, I don't know if we can answer questions on it yet, but we'll um, I'll try to talk it through the best we can. Okay, so let's see. We've got the trailer. <gasps> We got it right here. Let me go ahead and just start it back over. It's got the music, so I'll just kind of talk about it. Woo! So crossplay between PlayStation and Xbox. This plays on next gens. This is, uh, it's got a skin store. We know the price, we know the date, and you have early access if you go deluxe or higher. So is it deluxe and then ultimate? And then it looks like uh, you also have uh, closed beta access if you do the pre-order now. I don't know much more than that, but I mean, that's enough for me, right? Like, you know we're already going to be playing this, <laughs> you know? Like, oh, this is so good. Yeah, so actually that other post we're going to have later on today, which was meant to be earlier or, or about now-ish, um, it's going to go through uh, some of the things that are going on with the, the Rust console edition now and stuff. So it's going to be a good good read slash listen, yes? It's going to be fantastic. I get the attack helicopter. Oh, my goodness. I'm, dude, I'm out of my mind excited for this base building oh my goodness the raiding the farming the cheeks that must be clapped <laughs> yes raid them level three workbench beautiful this is all the stuff we wanted man let me just tell you this rust has been fun since it came out right up until now it's always been a blast so no matter what we're getting this game has always been fun no matter what and uh yeah it's just it's it's been great the entire ride of Rust. I, I can't think of a time when Rust was, like, bad. You know what I mean? Like, it's always been fun. So, uh, me personally, this is the only game I'm pre-ordering um, this entire year. And that's just me. Nobody's paying me to say that. This is my personal opinion. I'm all about this game. Always have been. I've always been supporting it uh, since it's been an early access on PC. And this is where we've wanting, been wanting to play this on, on console ever since we heard about it in 2013. So, uh, yeah, we're mad excited for this, and we can't wait to get in there. So, rest assured, as soon as the NDA is lifted, uh, the Boyfriend Squad, that's myself, Jade Monkey, Razor 2, BioLaser, will all be playing this live uh, on official servers, of course. And in the interim, you know, if the NDA is still out there, obviously we'll be on the PC version until then. And then, you know, as soon as they lift it, we'll be out there playing on the console edition. Yes, we'll be playing this on full release. Yes, we'll be playing this during early access. All of that good stuff. We're all over this, dude. We've been dying to play this for years on years on years. So I hope you guys are excited, too. Let me know if you guys have any questions or comments down below. And if you found this useful and helpful, be sure to drop a like. And if you're into open-world survival games like Rust, especially on the console, you know, consider dropping a subscribe and turning on those notifications if you think that's something you're into. I am so excited for this. And, yeah, keep a lookout for that next video that's coming out. It's going to help answer some of the questions that people have had. And it'll give us a little peek that we can kind of talk about before they lift the NDA, which is it's all good stuff. I'm all happy about it. It's all been good. Um, the beta has been going great so far. And uh, we've been having a great time. So, uh, yeah, can't wait, man. Cannot wait. I'm so excited that they finally released the information and we can, um, you know, do the pre-order. And hopefully we can talk about it soon enough. All right. So uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye. <laughs>